welcome to today's video. If you are new here, my name is Summer. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. As you can tell by the title, I am back at it again with another Amazon favorites video. These are my up-to-date current favorites, things that I use all the time that I wanted to share with you guys. I have 13 things specifically, all the way from jewelry to house decor to electronics. So can't wait to get into it, but before we do, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And if you enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up at the end. All right, guys, let's get right into it. My first thing is actually right here next to me, and this is a wide brim fedora hat. So on the inside, it says 57 centimeters, but I believe it's one size and they have it in a couple different colors. So they have it in black and they have it in tan. I actually have gotten the tan one before and I wasn't a huge fan, but the black one I've had for years, I put so many people onto it. So only right that I put you guys onto it. I also love that it has this little buckle detail on the side. I believe you can take it off if you want, but I just think it adds such a cute little flair to it. So this is how it looks on. You can obviously wear it kind of high up and further back. I have such a big forehead, so not always my favorite way to wear it, but you can also, of course, just wear it like a normal hat like this and tilt it up a little bit. And it's so cute. Oh, my earring just fell. We're just gonna ignore that for now. I just feel like it adds the perfect little bohemian vibe to any outfit. I'd probably pair this with a cute little summer dress and some heels or some wedges to go wine tasting or go to brunch or just any really daytime activities. It's perfect for summer, blocks out that sun, and it's just so cute. All right, the next item I'm going to share with you guys is this tripod stand that comes with its own mini ring light and a Bluetooth remote. So this thing has literally been my go-to for taking my own pictures for the past year or so. I'm obsessed with it. Honestly, I rarely ask anyone to take my pictures anymore because I just like how they come out better when I take them myself. myself. So you can adjust this part. This actually unstraps here and then you can make all of these sections, either taller or shorter, depending on obviously how tall or short you want the stand to be. And then it has the three legs at the bottom so you can open up the legs so it's nice and sturdy. I usually will put it on top of a chair because I'm pretty tall. And then I will clip my phone into the phone clip area. And then I most of the time won't even use the light because I take my pictures during daytime, but the light to use it, you do need to plug in. So here is the plug right here. And then the remote is Bluetooth compatible. So all you have to do is turn on your Bluetooth on your phone. There's a little remote right here. And I don't even know if this takes battery. I've never actually had to replace it, but you can connect to an iOS device. So an iPhone or an Android. Once it's connected to Bluetooth, you literally just press the button and it takes all your pictures for you. You can take it on Snapchat, Instagram, regular camera, you can take videos, all the nine yards. So this is so clutch. If you guys want, I will make a video on how I take my own pictures because I literally do it all the time now, like I said. So yeah, just let me know. All right, the next item I have for you guys is this remote. Now, this is not your typical remote this right here is a universal remote so this remote comes in i believe four or five different colors i just got black because it was simple and goes with everything but i just moved into a new place and when i moved in i lost the remote to my tv and i was so sad because i was like well how am i going to use my tv if i don't have a remote to use with it um and that's when my roommate told me well you can just buy a universal remote i think it was ten dollars and it's super easy to set up to your TV. It comes with a brochure and the brochure tells you exactly how to set it up, how to put in the code, depending on what kind of TV you have. And I set it up probably within five minutes. Um, only one time did I have a problem where it actually disconnected somehow on its own. And then I was able to reset it, like I said, again, within five minutes. And it works all the buttons, power button, volume button, input, all that good stuff it does it all so this is literally a game changer if you've lost your remote or if you just want a backup remote for any of your tvs okay the next item i'm going to share with you guys is just something that i personally think is so cute 
I was starting a new job probably ooh, almost two years ago and I was gonna be at a restaurant, also at a winery opening bottles and I obviously needed to get my own wine opener so that I could have it on hand at all times. So me being extra like I am, had to go and get this iridescent wine opener. So let me show you guys what it looks like. So it's a mixture of like greens, purples, pinks, um, and I just love it. So not only can you take off bottle tops, but you open it up, you have your screw, and you just pop it straight into your bottle of wine with the cork, and you open it. There's even a little cutter on the top, so if the top of your wine bottle is sealed, you can just cut it off. and. Honestly, there's nothing extra to it. There's nothing special about it. I just wanted to share it because I thought it was so cute and I think it's great to give as a gift, especially a housewarming gift. So if you're looking for something simple to give someone, I definitely recommend this. I've gotten a lot of compliments on it. The next item I have for you guys is actually a game. So I first played this game, oh, I want to say like a year ago. I can't remember where, but somebody had it and I fell in love with it. I think I was at a friend's birthday party and they had it. And it was just so fun for small groups. It's a quick game. It's fun to play as a drinking game, but obviously you can play it as a regular game as well. Kids can play it, adults can play it, friendly for all ages. And there are five or six mini games within the game. So this is Spot It. I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard of this game. And it's just perfect for on the go. You can take it like to the beach, if you're going on a picnic, if you're going on vacation. My family and I, whenever we travel, we always bring games with us. So I started bringing this game with us along with our spinner dominoes game. And like I said, it's just perfect because it's easy to take places with you. There's five or six games within these deck of cards that you can play with. And it's just cool because if you look at the cards, they all have different symbols on them and no two cards have more than one matching symbol on them, which is hard to believe. I have no idea how they created this. It blows my mind every time, but it's so cheap. It's so fun to just have at your house and keep when you have guests over or once again, to give somebody as a gift. All right, the next item I have for you guys is this quick tan instant self tanner bronzing spray in medium dark. So in my last Amazon video, I shared with you guys kind of like a body makeup spray that I use when I wanna just get rid of uneven areas in my skin, when I have tan lines and stuff like that. But this is for all over your body and it is an instant quick dry spray tanning solution I guess you could say um so I will just spray this on right before I know I'm gonna go to a pool to the beach um anywhere where I'm gonna be in the sun and I just want to look extra dark I especially love to use it in my stomach area because I feel like when my stomach is tan my abs just seem to pop out more and who doesn't like that so I will spray this all over my body or just the areas I know that are going to be showing that evening and it just gives me the perfect amount of bronzed color it actually used to be a lot cheaper than it was i swear i used to get it for like eight dollars and I, I believe it's twelve dollars now per can and they also sell them in packs of two um and i believe medium dark is the only color that they sell as well i could be wrong but i believe that's the only one i've seen on in, on instagram <laughs> on amazon but I do believe that it is complementary to all skin tones. So even if you're super pale or even if you are a little bit darker, it will still set on your skin really nicely. And like I said, it's instant drying. Um, so it'll just give you that nice sun kiss glow. Um, after It says after three days, but I use it for like a quick, quick tan when I need to be out the door and I'm going somewhere within a few hours. But it says right here, it shows you before... Um, and after and after three days that it does develop darker so you can use it as a developer but I just use it for same day okay so this next thing I feel like has been all the rage since quarantine started and TikTok started to pick up and people were making you know 
um, tie-dye videos of swimsuits and sweats and t-shirts and stuff like that and for a while it was hard to get your hands on any of it because every single person was trying to tie-dye something and make a video out of it but I did get my hands on this so this is the RIT brand all-purpose dye and this is in the color tan uh, they have tons of other colors on Amazon and it was literally less than three dollars I was shocked not only that I found it on Instagram but that it was such a affordable price as well I believe that they sell it in Walmart and Target and some other places but if you don't want to go out and buy it or if they don't have it there Amazon is your place to go get it I just got the tan because I think white and tan is just a really nice combo I love neutral colors so um, this is why I got this color but like I said they have tons of other colors so you can pick them up and you can um, use them on cotton material wool nylon and other materials as well so I got it because I wanted to dye a white swimsuit that I had and turn it into like a tie-dye more of a tan color because I feel like white swimsuits just get dirty really easily so if they're a different color it wouldn't get dirty as easily um, but I haven't been able to find a white sweatshirt or t-shirt that I really like to use it to dye also if you get this make sure you get the squirt bottle that will make it easier to actually dye your items but I just wanted to show you guys the actual dye because I was shocked that I even found it on um, Amazon the next item I have for you guys is a accessory. So I'm obsessed with jewelry and layering necklaces and um, finding earrings and stuff like that. So I know you guys are gonna ask. So by the way, my necklaces and my earrings are all from Forever 21. Sorry, I'm just trying to fix my earring. But what I'm gonna show you is obviously from Amazon. So this is a letter pendant and as you can tell the quality is so nice it's nice and shiny in the sun I just want you guys to be able to see the chain as well so I actually bought the the name sorry the letter pendant on its own that came with scratch that I bought the, the letter pendant from a seller and it came with a completely different necklace it was a much thicker and it was a lot longer i believe it's 18 inches and i didn't like it so i ended up purchasing this d more dainty necklace that i absolutely love and it's just so shiny and it goes well with the actual pendant they have tons of different sizes i believe from 15 to in 15 inch to 40 length this is 16 i'll show you guys a video i had it on earlier right before this um, of how long it is. I do wish it was a little bit longer. I probably should have got 17 or 18 But I didn't know at the time either way though. I still really love it and it's perfect for Layering with other necklaces as well. So I have other pendants that I want to wear so I'm definitely gonna buy more of this actual necklace from the same seller and Just use them on my other pendants that I never really get to get use out of because I for so long couldn't find a dainty necklace that I really liked that was good quality and by the way I never take it off I shower in it I sweat in it and so far so good so I can update you guys in the future in the description section if it does end up rusting but I've had it for I want to say like two weeks now and I never take it off and I've been in a pool I've been in the sun I've sweat I've been in the shower obviously <laughs> and so far no problems with the pendant or with the actual necklace so I will link them down below because like I said I purchased them separately and then I ended up combining them together all right one of my next Amazon favorites is actually something that I'm sure tons of you guys already have um, but I still wanted to share it because I actually have the older version and the newer version and that is the fire stick so I have the older version. I don't remember exactly what version number it is, but the newer version is the 4K. And I am obsessed with the 4K because as you can see, the two controllers are completely different. So first of all, on the 4K, which is the newer version, you have the power button, which turns off and controls not only the fire stick, but your TV as well, which is so clutch when you're laying in bed. Um, not only that, but it also has 
the controls to control how loud or not loud you have your TV set and then you can also mute your TV or program as well. So as you can see on the original one that I have, it doesn't have any of those features so I still have to use my universal remote to turn off the TV, to turn up the volume, turn down the volume, and to mute it but with the Amazon 4K, it does all of that for you. I will say that my older one is so much slower now, which is such a bummer, but definitely be on the lookout for Fire Sticks because they have sales all the time. I remember during last Christmas, they had buy one, get one free. And I was like, what? So I got, I purchased it and I got one for my mom and my dad. So they both would have one. And then I got one for myself too. So that's why I have the older version and then I have the newer version. And we actually have an Apple TV in our house too. I know some people are like straight Apple TV people and I totally get that. But if you wanna save a little bit more money and you still get all the same um, programs, apps, and features, then definitely just pay. Sorry guys, my camera completely overheated so I don't remember exactly what I was saying. But as you know, I will link these down below. I love my Fire Stick. If, you don't, if you're not an Apple TV person or if you just wanna get a little bit of a more affordable option then definitely go for the fire stick tv so the next thing i want to show you guys i'm not actually going to hold it up because it is a little bit big and it's in my living room and that is a wine rack that my mom actually gifted to me as a housewarming gift my roommate and i always keep wine on hand we always drink wine we love it um, and most of the time we are drinking red wine which is perfect to keep in the wrap rack because you don't have to have it refrigerated of course right now i don't have any wine on hand we drank it all but i will show you guys of course exactly uh, what the rack looks like and where i keep it i keep it next to our little alcohol tray where we keep other alcohol and glasses and it's just so cute it's the first thing you see when you walk in i love it it's super affordable and yeah it's just it's just cute to have in your apartment i'm not sure if they have other colors i don't think that they do but you don't have to assemble it or anything it just comes to you already made which i personally love because it is nice and simple all right the next thing i have for you guys is actually on my phone you guessed it that is my pop socket <laughs> um i've had this pop socket for for ever forever forever my phone case is not from amazon it is from i can't remember exactly the website i'll have to look i'll have to look it up and i'll let you guys know below but i'm obsessed with marble marble everything marble clothes marble countertops marble on top of my laptop cover <laughs> marble cases um i just think that it's so cute and obviously there's so many different colors of marble you can get if you want to stick with a white one stick with a white one if you want to get fun ones like this you can get fun ones like this but anyway i had gotten this phone case and i was looking for a pop socket to match and i ended up finding this one on amazon that was literally exactly the same let me put it closer for you guys sorry don't judge my nails i did them myself and now they're all chipped but this is how it looks and then obviously it pops out. I don't know how people honestly don't have pop sockets because I'm constantly holding my phone like this. And I remember before I had one, I literally had an indent on the inside of my pinky, still probably there because I would just always hold my phone like this. So it would rest on my poor little pinky and my pinky hated me. And finally I got the pop socket. So now I hold it like this. Don't have to worry about anything underneath. Um, and yeah, it's cheap. They have a bunch of different styles and I love it. It sticks good. Never have to worry about it. I've never had to worry about it unsticking or anything like that. So yeah, definitely check that out if you're looking for a pop socket or to give a pop socket to somebody who needs one or if you just want to have extra on hand because why not? All right, the last thing I have for you guys is something that's super sentimental to me and close to my heart, and it is a daily devotional that I love to read. I've actually gifted this to a ton of people in my life just because I feel like I connect with it so much, and I hope to be able to give the same thing to other people, and that is my Jesus Calling book. I've had this for years, since I was in college, so at least four years now, um, and I just always reread it whenever I get to the end. I just start again from the beginning. There's dates in it so you can go by the date but like right now I'm on May 22nd and it's June 
18th, so I'm definitely way behind. But I try to read one passage at least right when I wake up or right before I go to bed. Usually right before I go to bed, but it's also a great way to start your day as well. I just need to get more into the routine. I'm so bad at waking up and like getting things done. I lag, I lay in bed, I go on my phone and it's not a good habit. But if you're good at having morning routines, then this will be so perfect for you in such a fresh refreshing way to start your day. So this is what it looks like on the inside. There is a devotional on each side, like I said, with the date, and then it tells you where it is from exactly in the Bible. So Romans 8, 31 32, Micah 7, 7, 1 Peter 5, 6, John 14, 6. So um, they just take a, a, a bunch of stuff from the Bible and it's kind of written in a way that people can relate to because if you read the bible a lot of times the language that it's written in it's hard to understand or decipher exactly what they are trying to tell you because it was written obviously a long time ago so this is just a more easy to read and relatable way to just talk to God and speak to God every day. So my mom actually is the one who gifted this to me a while ago and she wrote me a little note. So I just want to share it with you guys. Ooh, this was on January, February, March, April, April in 2014. So I've actually had it for six years. That's a long time. So she wrote some, may these daily inspirations help to ease your mind and help you to let go and trust that God will always be there for you. Such a simple concept yet so hard to do. Ask Jesus for anything and everything. Watch your worries go away. So as I'm glad that I read that because a lot of the devotionals touch on just trusting God and asking him for any and everything. He wants you to ask him for things. He wants you to be thankful for things. He wants you to come to him when you're worried or you have fears. He wants to be a part of your life at all times. And this is just a good reminder of that. So when I read it, I immediately pray after and I just take my time with God and I thank him or I tell him you know what I'm worried about or what I need help with and I just feel like it really puts me at ease and just puts me in such a good headspace so if you're interested in something like this daily devotional I highly highly recommend this you don't even really need to be religious of course it speaks um, as if God is speaking to you but it's just a good way to just be spiritual and stay positive and stay happy in times when you might need that uplifting spirit and guidance. All right guys that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed all of the items that I shared with you. I tried to kind of do a mix of a lot of different things that way it can reach everyone and you can hopefully find at least one thing that you really like and you would want to go buy. If you have any questions as always let me know in the comments below or if you've used any of this stuff I would actually really love to know um, especially the dye I would love to know if you guys have made anything with it because I think that's super awesome I love DIY stuff so yeah if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you haven't already check out my other Amazon video I will definitely link that down below and I will link everything that I shared here as always and I hope to see you guys in my next video Mwah.